He's like, hey, what's up, man? It's you. Like, how come, where's all the content? Where have you been? So I want to tell you about this wedding that I went to today. And I'll tell you soon what it has to do with Pokemon and my channel. Well, I go to this wedding, we're Asian, right? And uh, this person is on my wife's side. She's getting married to an African guy, uh, Nigerian. So we had two different cultures clashing and it was fun. I got to try uh, tomato rice for the first time. And damn, that was good Nigerian rice, man. I don't know who else eats it like this, but I had some uh, some fish and whatever whatever else was there. It was so good, and the dancing was cool. You know the the uh, the African type Afro music. It was it was so fun, right? Like you know, like <laughs> but I met somebody there that recognized me on my channel, the pullout game, and he's like, "Hey, what's up, man? It's you. Like, how come? Where's all the content? Where have you been?" And I just tell him, you know. I, didn't, I don't really know what direction to take my, my videos, my content. So I've been kind of slow on this. And honestly, I've just been slacking a lot. Uh, and also, I got this today. Uh, before I show you what's inside, um, I'll just tell you about this, this little wedding here. Um, and I'll give you guys clues to guess what's inside. So uh, I'll let you know that it's a red and black Pokemon. And it's not weak. It's pretty strong. That's your first guess. So I'll slowly open this as we go. But this wedding is like me and my wife were at. And uh, I don't know, man. Like this person, you know who you are, came up to me and said, you know, you're that guy. Like, I like your stuff. Now, I never imagined that somebody would recognize me. Like, like for this small channel, right? I, I never thought anybody would come out and, and, and know who I am. Especially because you don't see my face all the time. Most most of the time we're focused on Pokemon cards. Like, let's be honest, right? You watch my content for maybe me. Uh, and mostly for Pokemon consumerism. Now, it's been super hard to get Pokemon cards or the, the cards that we all want, right? Things look to be getting better. I actually went to Target and found a bunch of Battle Styles st uh, stacked up, stocked up. I guess they're trying to get rid of it before they stop selling. So it's been there. People are not buying it like crazy anymore. Chainlink Rain is coming out next week at the time of this video. And uh, uh, Evolving Skies is coming out three months after that, which is pretty awesome. People are so excited for the evolutions. And uh, in Chilling Rain, I really like those birds. Still going with the birds, man. The Galarian birds is so awesome. I don't think they're going to get old for me and I will keep trying to collect them and sell them on my store, which should be up soon. And tip number two is it is a legendary Pokemon in here. Legendary Pokemon. All right. I've got the card right here. I can't show you what it is because it's double sided. There are two of them. It is a dark Pokemon. Look at that dark right there. And if I give you any more guesses it'll probably be too easy but it is a legendary pokemon um yeah and it's not modern it's not ultra vi ultra vintage so somewhere in in between pretty awesome pokemon pretty amazing now at this wedding right i'm realizing like yo it doesn't it doesn't matter where you're from it doesn't matter who you're 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 with or what you're experiencing like me pokemon was out of my life for a long time i didn't want to do pokemon because it was like not cool right it's kind of embarrassing for a guy my age approaching 30 to go out of his way to buy a, a toy that says ages six and up <laughs> ages six and up and for me to have a channel called pull out game where i pull out kids products uh yeah you see where this is going right so i think i just need a constant reminder that there are people out there that do like the content that is being made here and there are people who enjoy this stuff just like me which you know i don't need validation like i don't need fame or anything but 
the 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 fun of it was kind of sucked out for a while because the whole Pokemon stuff, all the trading cards, sports cards, it's been very frustrating, and you have to cut, you have to go through so many obstacles to get the stuff you want, and and you end up spending too much money. And right now, I had like recently I had some money problems, so yeah, I didn't have all the inventory. I still got all my stuff here, stuff going up on the store soon, stuff here. Yeah, so I do have a, a, a stuff to, to sell. I've got uh, some shiny fates. I've got a lot of battle styles. So <clears throat> uh, I'll put that in the link below. Hopefully I have it all updated soon so I can I can set it up. I will let you guys go on it and buy what you want, but it won't be all my stuff yet. Well, that's not the point. The point is I'm back. <laughs> the point is that I am back. We're going to test our pullout game more frequently now. I've gone a month without... Um, showing you guys how I pull out. So this is not on, on Pornhub. This is on YouTube, hopefully. And we are going to show what I just pulled out today. If you have your guess, go ahead and type it in the comments. There won't be a prize because, you know, I'm going to show you anyways. But three, two, one. Evil Tall. Evil Tall, Yvetto, however you want to say it. This Pokemon is awesome. Uh, I just, I like Amazing Rares. I'm just collecting Amazing Rares. So I have this. I bought two of them. Are there two or three in here? I think there are four. <laughs> yeah, I probably got this at a claim sale. I've had this sitting in my room for a couple weeks now. I just haven't opened it. I got four of them. Yeah, see that right there? Double-sided. I like Amazing Rares. And... I luckily kept all my Vivid Voltage Amazing Rares. Zacian, Zamazenta, Jirachi, Celebi, Raikou. I've got like nine Raikous. And uh, the most important one, Rayquaza. I just kept those. I opened a lot of Vivid Voltage when it first came out. Uh, I think at this point, people were not too crazy about Vivid Voltage because there was no Charizard in it. But eventually, people started realizing that, hey, this set is majorly uh, underprinted. So it started going up in price right now. Right now, Vivid Voltage Booster Box is hovering around $200, $200 and uh, ETB is around $85, $80, bucks, which is ridiculous for just a regular, a regular ETB that came out half a year ago. Like, bro, uh, yeah, I'm just happy that Pokemon is going to be easier to find in stores now. Local game stores should have what you want. Pre-orders for the new sets are coming out soon and tomorrow for a lot of websites, I think. As of right now, for Chilling Rain, I'm excited for that. But get ready to get your pullout game tested once more because we need to see what Pokemans we can pull. And I will have my cards that I pull for sale, most of them at least, the ones I want to sell. I will have them in my Shopify store. So look out for that in the link below. Get on my email list to get uh, on the giveaways and to see products available first. I will email people. I will email everybody when I update my website, update my stock inventory. So if you want to be the first to see what I get in, then go ahead and give me your email in the link below. Cool. Thanks. Bye-bye.